Hey everyone, welcome to our very first home theater showcase video. I am on location right here in Raleigh. We've got our founder of Audio Vice, Mr. Leon Shaw, with us today to talk about this incredible home theater that we just finished up. Uh, one thing that kind of took me away when I first walked in was the screen size um, and how awesome this room is. But I don't want to steal any thunder from you. I want to let you kind of tell everybody what went into making this home theater a reality. We're actually on top of a new garage that was added onto the house to allow the theater to be built. It's, uh, it's a large room. There were basically two goals uh, for this theater, to seat a lot of people. And the decision was actually made to, that you know probably 98% of the time, it's just the couple at home. So they did a row of really nice Cinematech chairs. They're top of the line chairs, which are super comfortable. Then for the overflow, when there was a bunch of people here, just kind of basic movie theater rockers, which, costs a lot less sure. to do yeah. that. Uh, the other goal was to have incredible sound. So the theater has some really great gear in it and the homeowner kind of wanted the theater have this industrial look. So it's not your typical, all the speakers are hidden kind of theater. You, there, there's a lot of speakers exposed I noticed in here. that, like when yeah. I walked in, you've got exposed speakers, the subs are exposed. You can see the subs, yeah. You can see the Atmos speakers, the surround speakers are all kind of exposed to give it kind of that industrial look. We even put the screen and hung it from uni struts. It's an acoustically transparent screen. It's probably the best sounding screen out there. It's made by Seymour. Uh, and there's big JBL speakers behind it that you can't see. So I think it is really cool when you get a screen that almost or totally fills the room wall to wall. It just gives you this really great impression when you walk into the room. It's, it's 17 feet wide, translates into a 221 inch 2.40 diagonal screen. So it's the wide screen for yep. movies and you can sports show up just fine here too. This homeowner wanted a really close field of vision. They wanted to feel like they're fully immersed in the film and it's just amazing. So how many, okay, so how many subs overall do we have in the theater? Five subs. Five total subs. And then how many overall speakers are inside? Well, total with the uh, subs, there's 16 speakers in 16 here. So it's a full speakers. Atmos 11 channel surround sound and then the five subs. So we didn't skip. skimp out on, no skipping. No <laughs> on skipping. sound. So <laughs> no. definitely the goal of great sound was achieved. Yes. Okay, correct. so now behind the scenes, behind the wall that you can't see are all pretty much the brains of the operation. So talk to us a little bit about what's behind the scenes that we can't see all of the rack gear, so to speak. So this is, I think, the best way to do a theater. If you notice, you can't even see the projector. Yep. There was a purpose-built closet right centered on the room and the projector is hidden in there. There's a projection window. So there's a big Sony projector in there with a panamorph lens on it. Um, a great data set processor, Mark Levinson amplifiers for the main three channels across okay. the front. Um, and just, we used a Kaleidoscape movie server, a Cambridge Audio Blu-ray player. There's a Roco 4K player, and there's a satellite dish from Dish Network that's 4K as well. So that's not the lacking sources. options for no. sources either. Yes, it's all 4K ready. It's controlled with Control 4. And uh, it just, it turned out great. The sound and picture are just amazing. All right, so if I'm at home and I want a home theater and I want audio advice to design and build my home theater for mm -hmm. me, what does that process look like? Well, first, it depends if you have an existing room or if you're starting from scratch. In this case, there was actually flexibility to make it the size we wanted. We got the risers the right height and everything. So this was probably actually easier once it was all planned out than a room that was existing. Sure. But we need to get a set of plans that we either come out and take measurements, or you may have a set of plans you could send us. And we'll ask you some questions about what are your goals for the theater? Do you like sports over movies? Are movies more important? Is it everything? Do you want to listen to music in the theater? How many people do, do you need it to seat? Um, and then, you know, of course there's a budget range because theaters can be from you know, $10,000 yeah. for a great theater all to the way all the way as, as much as you want yeah. to spend. We then design the theater for you. We'll draw out sight lines, figure out the right riser height. A lot of times we even get you into the store to figure out what size screen feels comfortable for you based upon the distance you're gonna be sitting from the screen in your room. So you know, if you're sitting in one of our theaters and say, this feels great, and we know you're sitting a little closer in your theater, we'll have to make the screen slightly smaller. Yep. If you're further away, make it slightly bigger. And then we'll work up some, some audio packages that will go in the room, decide whether you want to not see anything, or like this, see everything. 
and then we come up with a couple of designs and go from there. Then once that's finalized, we start the install work. We'll have to wire the room with great speaker cable and uh, for good power, and then we'll install it and calibrate it, and then you'll be smiling. Hey, thanks everybody for tuning in. I hope you've enjoyed this first showcase video of a home theater that we've installed. We actually install over a hundred home theaters every single year. So you're gonna get a whole host of home theater showcases coming very, very soon. Thank you so much for you're joining welcome. us and talking through uh, this home theater. If you are curious about what it takes to put a home theater together, again, we have a Raleigh location. We also have a Charlotte, North Carolina location, and we have online. All three can help you. So come on in or go to the website, audioadvice.com, chat, call us. We will be happy to help you plan and design and build your dream home theater much like this one. Thank you.